Have you ever wondered what it would be like to embark on an Arctic adventure? The Arctic, a world of pristine white landscapes shimmering under the aurora borealis. This is a place where the air is so crisp it tickles your lungs, and the silence is so profound it echoes. It's a land that tempts the adventurer within us, promising an experience like no other. Imagine yourself camping in the Arctic with nothing but the vast expanse of snow stretching out as far as the eye can see. The thrill of setting up camp in this winter wonderland is an experience that goes beyond ordinary. It's about surviving and thriving in an environment that's as challenging as it is beautiful. And when night falls, you're treated to a celestial spectacle that's second to none. The northern lights painting the sky in hues of green and purple, a sight that makes the freezing temperatures worth it. But the Arctic isn't just about enduring the cold. It's also about embracing the wilderness and the unique opportunities it provides. Hunting, for instance, is an integral part of life here. It's not about the pursuit of game, but the respect for the balance of nature and the thrill of the chase in this vast, untamed wilderness. It's a testament to the primal connection we have with nature, a connection that's often forgotten in our digital world. And then there's mushing. The exhilarating rush of gliding across the snow with a team of sled dogs leading the way. Mushing isn't just a mode of Arctic transportation, it's a tradition, a bond between man and dog, and an adventure in itself. The rhythm of the dog's paws against the snow, the whoosh of the sled, the cold wind against your face, it's a symphony of sensations that's unique to the Arctic. So, you see, an Arctic adventure isn't just a trip, it's a journey of discovery, of pushing your limits, of reconnecting with the wild, it's the ultimate thrill. Let's dive deeper into these unique Arctic adventures and discover the ins and outs of each one. Imagine pitching a tent in a snow-covered landscape surrounded by nothing but a blanket of white. This is Arctic camping. Now let's delve into the nitty-gritty of Arctic camping starting with the essentials. The gear you need must be top-notch, designed to withstand the harshest of conditions. Your tent should be a four-season, designed to handle heavy snowfall and high winds. Your sleeping bag should be rated for sub-zero temperatures, and your clothing should be layered to keep you warm, yet versatile enough to prevent overheating during strenuous activities. The best time to embark on this icy adventure is during the Arctic summer, from June to September. This period offers 24 hours of sunlight, known as the midnight sun, and temperatures that can reach a balmy 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Don't be fooled though, this is still the Arctic, and the weather can change in a heartbeat, always be prepared for a sudden drop in temperature. Staying warm is a matter of life and death in the Arctic. The key is layering. Start with a moisture-wicking base layer to keep sweat away from your skin. Add an insulating middle layer like fleece or down to retain body heat. Finally, an outer layer that's wind and waterproof will keep you dry and shielded from the elements. Remember, it's easier to cool down than warm up, so when in doubt, layer up. Footwear is another crucial aspect of your gear. Your boots should be insulated, waterproof, and roomy enough to accommodate thick socks. Frozen feet are not only uncomfortable but can lead to frostbite, a serious and potentially life-threatening condition. Hydration and nutrition are often overlooked aspects of staying warm. Your body needs fuel to generate heat, so high-calorie foods are essential. Likewise, staying hydrated helps maintain your body's temperature regulation, so don't skip on the water, even if you're not feeling thirsty. Arctic camping comes with its unique set of challenges. The isolation can be daunting, and the constant sunlight can mess with your sleep pattern. Wildlife, like polar bears, are a serious concern, so bear-proofing your camp and carrying bear spray is a must. Despite these challenges, the rewards are immense. There's a tranquility found only in the Arctic's vast expanses, punctuated by the occasional sighting of its unique wildlife. Then there's the Northern Lights, a celestial ballet of light that dances across the sky, casting an ethereal glow on the snow-covered landscape. This alone is worth braving the cold, and let's not forget the sense of accomplishment that comes from surviving in one of the harshest environments on our planet. Arctic camping is an experience like no other, testing your survival skills in one of the most extreme environments on Earth. In the Arctic wilderness, hunting is not just a sport. It's a way of life. A statement that rings true for those who've experienced the thrill and challenge of pursuing the wild game in the land of snow and ice. The Arctic is home to an array of unique and resilient wildlife, each adapted to survive in these harsh conditions. Let's begin with the caribou, a symbol of the Arctic and a crucial part of the ecosystem. Caribou are known for their annual migrations, traveling great distances in search of food. 
They're also known for their distinctive antlers, which both males and females grow. These creatures are not just a source of food for the local Inuit communities, but also provide materials for clothing and tools. Now imagine the sight of a musk ox, a majestic creature with long, shaggy hair and curved horns. These beasts, built to withstand the freezing temperatures, can be a challenging quarry due to their strength and herd behavior. Hunting them requires a careful approach as they're known to form defensive circles when threatened. And then, there's the king of the Arctic, the polar bear. The world's largest land predator hunting them is strictly regulated due to their vulnerable status. While they may not be a common target for hunters, their mere presence adds to the thrill of the hunt. Hunting in the Arctic is governed by strict laws, aimed at conserving the wildlife and respecting the rights of indigenous communities. It's crucial to understand and follow these laws which detail the hunting seasons, quotas, and permitted methods. The best time for hunting usually coincides with the migrations of the animals, often in the spring and fall. Hunting techniques in the Arctic have been honed over centuries, blending traditional knowledge with modern methods. The Inuit, for instance, have long used techniques such as stalking and ambushing, using the landscape to their advantage. Today's hunters also use tools such as snowmobiles and GPS devices. But the principles of patience, precision, and respect for the animal remain the same. Finally, it's important to note that hunting in the Arctic is not for the faint-hearted. It requires physical fitness, survival skills, and a deep understanding of the environment. It's about more than just the pursuit of game. It's about immersing oneself in the wilderness, testing one's limits, and experiencing a connection with nature that's hard to find elsewhere. Arctic hunting is a thrilling and challenging experience that requires skill, patience, and respect for the wilderness. So, whether it's the sight of a caribou herd against the backdrop of the midnight sun, the thrill of tracking a musk ox, or the awe-inspiring presence of a polar bear, hunting in the Arctic is an adventure like no other. Feel the rush of the wind as you glide across the snow-covered landscape, led by a team of powerful sled dogs. This is mushing. Let's take a journey back in time. Mushing has a history that goes back thousands of years, a vital lifeline for Arctic communities. It was the primary mode of winter travel for Arctic indigenous people, long before the advent of snowmobiles and planes. The sport evolved from a necessary survival skill into a thrilling pastime, a testament to the resilience and ingenuity of these communities. The sled dogs themselves, often Alaskan Malamutes or Siberian Huskies, are remarkable creatures. Bred for strength, endurance, and a thick coat to withstand the harsh Arctic conditions, these dogs are the heart and soul of any mushing team. Their unwavering loyalty, boundless energy, and keen sense of direction are what make them the perfect companions for navigating this icy terrain. But, of course, mushing isn't just about hopping on a sled and letting the dogs do all the work, it requires skill, knowledge, and a deep understanding of these amazing animals. Each dog has its own personality, strengths, and weaknesses. It's up to the musher to recognize these traits, form a cohesive team, and guide them safely across the Arctic wilderness. The sled itself is a marvel of simple, efficient design. Made of lightweight, durable materials, it's designed to glide smoothly over the snow while carrying supplies and, of course, the musher. Steering a sled involves shifting your weight and using a combination of vocal commands to direct the dogs. It's a delicate balance of control and trust, a dance between man and nature. Taking care of the dogs is a crucial part of the musher's responsibility. They're not just transport, they're family. Regular feeding, grooming, and health checks are essential, as is providing them with plenty of rest and love. The bond between a musher and their dogs is one of mutual respect and affection, a relationship that only strengthens with each journey they take together. Navigating the Arctic terrain is no easy task. It's an ever-changing landscape, with the weather and terrain posing constant challenges. A keen eye for potential dangers, a good understanding of the dog's capabilities, and a deep respect for the power of nature are all vital for a safe and successful journey. As you can see, mushing is not just a mode of transportation, it's a way of life. It embodies the spirit of the Arctic, its harsh beauty, its challenges, and the incredible resilience of both its people and animals. It's a connection to a time-honored tradition, a thrilling adventure, and an unforgettable bond between man and dog. Mushing is more than just a mode of transportation, it's an age-old tradition, a thrilling adventure, and a unique bond between man and dog. Camping, hunting, and mushing in the Arctic are not just activities, they are experiences that challenge and thrill, offering unmatched adventures. 
Let's take a moment to step back and encapsulate the essence of this frosty escapade. We dove into the ultimate thrill of Arctic camping, an exercise that tests your mettle in ways you wouldn't have thought possible. Imagine spending a night under the sky so clear, it's like looking through a window into the universe itself. The Arctic landscape, though harsh and unforgiving, offers a tranquility hard to find elsewhere. We also explored the art of survival in the cold, where every breath you take is a testament to your resilience. The Arctic cold is a formidable adversary, but with the right gear and knowledge it becomes a catalyst for an unforgettable adventure. And let's not forget the wild game. Hunting in the Arctic is not just about the pursuit, but also about understanding and respecting the balance of nature. It's a dance between predator and prey, a primal connection between man and beast. Then we delved into the world of mushing, a mode of transportation that is as thrilling as it is practical. To command a team of dogs as they navigate through the snowy landscape is to experience a bond of trust and teamwork that transcends species. Each of these elements, camping, surviving the cold, hunting, and mushing come together to create the Arctic adventure experience. They are the threads that weave the fabric of an extraordinary journey. A journey that is as much about discovering the Arctic as it is about discovering oneself. The Arctic is a land of extremes, offering adventures like no other. It's a place where the sun can shine at midnight, where you can witness the ethereal dance of the northern lights, where the silence is so profound it can almost be touched. It's a place that invites you to step out of your comfort zone, to embrace the unknown, and to truly feel alive. The Arctic is a land of extremes, offering adventures like no other. Will you dare to embark on your own Arctic adventure?